Thank you for signing up with SGS College for your Level 2 Fitness Instructor qualification. This is a reps recognised qualification and, is in, and has industry standards applied. The qualification runs through February half term from the 17th of February right the way through to the 21st of February and it's a one week intensive programme. The programme is in co collaboration with Pure Gym and you will have the opportunity to use those facilities on two days of the programme. We are based at the WISE campus in Stoke Gifford and the first day we will need you to report to reception at the WISE campus and wait in the hub for collection at 9.30. Our base room for the week will be F64 which you'll be shown to by the lecturer on the first day. The delivery plan. So the delivery plan looks a little bit different to what um, we originally signed up for. I know we talked about 2.30 finish, but there's quite a lot of content to get through. So there are different finishes on different days. So we look at Monday, we've got a 9.30 to 3.30 finish. Um, in the morning, you'll be doing an A&P masterclass with Jordan Morris, and then you'll sit an exam. Uh, prior to this, you'll have some flip learning where I will send it in an email, and you'll be able to revise the content from that exam. The masterclass is key. It's an hour delivery from a member of staff here, and they will teach you everything you need to know to be able to pass that exam. In the afternoon, you'll be doing business theory. Um, which will have a worksheet and you'll need to submit on the final day, on, on Monday, the anatomy exam, the flipped work for unit two and three, and the unit six, which you've done on the Monday. Tuesday, you will have uh, a client consultation and health screening test, uh, testing, so BMI, um, heart rate, etc. Um, and in the afternoon, you'll have fitness instructor skills session. Um, and on the end of that day, you'll need to submit your client consultation and the record of the health screening tests. Wednesday is 9.30 till 4 o'clock. In the morning, you'll have some theory around the warm-up and cool-down, uh, warm-up and CV theory. Um, and then in the afternoon, you'll have skill development and formative assessment of the CV and re resistance training. At the end of that day, you'll need to submit part of your case study for Unit 5 and you will have a formative assessment of your CV and, um, and resistance training. Thursday starts at 9.30 and finishes at 4 o'clock. Uh, in the AM you'll have some theory around the cool down and resistance training and in the PM you will have skill development and formative assessment again of the CV and resistance training. You'll submit the second part of your case study for Unit 5 and you'll have a formative assessment again of the CV and resistance. Friday is your practical assessment where every uh, learner is required to attend at 9.30. In the initial part of the morning there will be an opportunity for learners to go through the practical assessment amongst themselves and start to prepare themselves and then throughout the day there will be practical assessments scheduled. The finish time for this day is 2.30. At the end of the day you will need to submit a written evaluation of your session that you've delivered and then finally make sure that you submit everything within the portfolio and on this day you'll be given a checklist and you can check through your portfolio to make sure all the evidence is present. So prior to starting the course on the 17th, an email is, is, has been sent and the email contains numerous files. The first file or folder you will find is Unit 1, Anatomy and Physiology for Exercise. Within this file you will find an anatomy PowerPoint and this is your revision document. You will use this document to revise as much as you possibly can and then you will also have uh, an anatomy practice paper where you can test your knowledge based on what the retention of information from the PowerPoint. Don't panic if you're not able to ret retain all the information. We appreciate this, there are a lot of slides and there's a lot of information to take on board and that's why we've put the Anatomy Masterclass on on the first hour of the first day. But please do try and retain as much as you possibly can. Unit 2, there is a folder in the email containing uh, a, power, a PDF guide for Unit 2 and a workbook. It's really important that you download the workbook and print it. When you download the workbook and print it, prior to starting on the 17th, you will need to complete that workbook. It's, a, it's a literally a tick box exercise, ticking the correct answers. Use the PDF guide to support you to find the right answers. And much of it is, much of it is sort of common sense and, and best practice. Um, 
but please use the book workbook to support you where unsure. Unit three, supporting clients' health and well-being. You will find a folder with a PowerPoint and a workbook. Again, please download the workbook and print it. You're required to use the PowerPoint to support you and your understanding. This workbook is a tick box exercise, so you'll just literally tick the boxes to, to the right answers. Um, if you're unsure, use the PowerPoint to support you. Again, a lot of it is common sense. It can be researched online, but the PowerPoint has most of the information that you need to be able to answer the questions. Both Unit 2 and 3 must be printed, completed prior to the start of the program, and Unit 1, must be uh, you must have revised the material to be able to be ready to sit that exam. As I said, Unit 1 will have a master class at the, on the first day of delivery where all of the content will be summarized, ready for you to be able to sit that exam in the morning. Finally, if you have any queries, please contact us and use the email address here. It's jack.watts at sgscole.ac.uk. And thank you again for Pure Gym to supporting our delivery.